Hey, I just want to welcome you back to Mr. Cast Iron, and I've had the privilege of getting this 11-in-1 multi-tool sent to me from Rover Tack. Uh, it's great for camping and hiking and hunting, uh, fishing and survival, and even for a car tool. You could put this in your glove box and carry this tool with you uh, because it has like an axe head on it, a hammer head, and several other tools here. And what I want to do, I'm going to kind of show you some of these things. Let me get it out of the box first and uh, show you this nice sheath that it comes in and uh, it actually has a loop here where you could put it on your belt loop if you wanted to on a belt and carry it on your side and it even has a protection here for the axe head portion of it uh, so you don't cut yourself because this thing is very sharp now i mean it's uh, we're going to go outside in just a little bit and I'm going to show you how we can shave some kindling or whatever for uh, firewood. But as you can see, there, there's a hammer head here. Also, there are some screw heads here. A Phillips screw head, number one, number two, and number three Phillips heads. So you could use this as a screwdriver and a flat head also. And um, so that's got this nice place for these bits to fit. And uh, then there's several things here. Uh, basically, you just open these up like this. You have a saw blade where you can use to saw some limbs with. And uh, then here is a file. And it also has a screwdriver uh, tip on the end of it where you can use it also uh, to tighten a screw with. But there's a couple other things here I want to show you. If you're doing this for survival or you're out camping or whatever, here you have a bottle opener. And also this end here can open up a can. Like if you have a tin can of food or whatever and you needed to open it up and you didn't have a can opener, these are actually can openers. And of course you got a knife blade here so you could shave or cut if you needed to cut anything, cut meat or if you needed to um, like we're going to go out in a little bit. I'm going to show you how to use this axe head and this knife to cut on a piece of limb or whatever to make some kindling to build a fire with. <clears throat> now, there's a couple things else I want to show you here on this that I think is very neat because it is a safety feature that Rover Tack has thought about doing here. Uh, not only do you have all these pieces here that you can use, but just say you wanted to use this saw and you wanted to close these other ones up. This has a locking feature. Hear how it locks in place? So that way it won't close up on your finger when you're sawing uh, a limb or whatever. And you just squeeze that down and that'll close up, fold it back up. You can pull the other pieces out or whatever. And, and any one of them will lock in place. So you, you can keep those locked in like if you needed to use this file. Uh, to file down something you got it locked in place all you have to do is hit this little button here push it down and it'll easily fold back into the handle like that so we're going to go outside i'm going to get a limb and i'm going to show you how to use this uh, axe head portion of it of course this is really neat too having this hammer head uh, there's a lot of times that you need to hammer in uh, tent pegs or something like that and uh, so it's easy to do. So this is a handy little rig for camping and, and uh, hunting, fishing, whatever. But it's also, like I said earlier, it's very great for someone to keep in the glove box of their car. And that way, in case you ever had, you know, any kind of, um, you know, car problems or car troubles or whatever, and you may need one of these or many of these different types of, of tools, you could have that real handy. It's very small. It's only about six or eight inches long. You could have that in your glove box and you could use this, you know, to try to help uh, repair whatever the situation may be. Okay, and I'm going to go ahead and put the sheath back on this axe head before we go outside. But you may have been wondering why we had uh, you know, screwdriver bits and everything and where they may be because they wasn't on any of these tools down here. But all you have to do is just take and slide this out the bottom. And up here on the very top is where these fit into place here. So you can use that, you know, as a screwdriver. And like I said, you've got three different bits here. Uh, and you just slide these right back in place. And uh, you got a place to keep those and store those. There's Two different Phillips bits and then one flathead. So uh, that, that, that's real handy if you need to, you know, use these for a screwdriver. So that's really cool right there. That was pretty thoughtful of them. 
uh, to come up with that. So anyway, and it just locks back in place. Okay, here we are out here at our fire pit. And so if you were camping or whatever, just take your sheath off, you know, and you can use this to, to chop firewood with or cut a limb or whatever you needed to do. And then also, of course, we have the knife blade portion of this. And remember, it just locks in place. And so if you needed to shave some or whatever, to shave a little kindling off to get your fire started or whatever, you could easily do that. And then this just folds back up in place like that and then you've got your sheath here and like i said if you have to have something to that you needed to beat on with for a hammer like if you needed to drive a tent peg into the ground you can easily do that with the hammerhead portion of it be sure and use this protective sheath to go back onto the axe head portion so you don't cut yourself because it's very sharp but folks i'm just telling you this is a nice product this is something that i think not only men but women also would enjoy using for, as a gift you could give this to someone that likes to hunt and fish uh, that likes to camp and go hiking or uh, maybe like i said just as a protective measure uh, to carry in your glove box in case you needed a screwdriver or something like that to you know help get a repair going where you can get back to safety so anyway we thank rover tac for uh, sending this to us and allowing us to review this and uh, i think i'm going to really enjoy this product so